Hey everyone, and welcome back to Sugar and Spice Hairstyles. I'm Stacy. I'm Carrie. And today we're going to be doing a combination braid for you guys. We're going to be doing a laced feather braid into a ladder braid. So today's video is a two for one. And we're also going to show you a couple of different ways that you can style this style. If you like this video, please do give it a thumbs, thumbs up, up and click subscribe down below. That would really help support our channel and we would greatly appreciate it. Now, without any further ado, let's jump right on into the tutorial. Okay, so to start this style, you can part it in the middle or on either side. It really doesn't matter. Hers is parted a little bit to the left of center. So we're going to start on the right side because that's the side where the most hair is hanging down. So we're just going to pick up a section in the front here, just like you were starting a French braid or a Dutch braid. We're going to split it into three, and I'm going to cross the bottom over the middle, and then the top over the middle, and then one more time the bottom over the middle, and then when I cross the top over on the second time, I'm going to pick up a small section from the top and add in with it. And this is where it becomes a lace braid because we're only going to add in hair on the top. Now, when we go to the bottom, the way I like to do this is I go ahead and cross the bottom strand over. And then I'm going to take a tiny section, just a small slither of hair because you don't want to, you don't want to run out of hair. And I took that from the piece where I added in hair on the top. Now I'm going to add in another piece, another section of hair to the top and then cross over that bottom strand and then take a little section from that. And this is where it becomes a feather braid because these are like little feathers from the braid. It's also kind of like a faux fake waterfall braid. So we're going to keep repeating these steps. The braid is going to go around the crown of her head and back behind um, the top of this ear on the left side. And we're just going to repeat the exact same steps till we get to that section. Okay, so I'm going to add in one last section. As you can see, her ear through all of her hair <laughs> is right there. So it's like right above the back of her ear. And that's the last section I'm going to add in. So I'm going to remove one more feather from that section. Now, uh, for here, I'm just going to finish this braid off in a regular three strand braid. Okay, once you've braided down near the ends, you're just gonna take a small elastic and secure those ends. Okay, so once you have um, finished this braid off, you're going to go back to the other side and pick up a section of hair underneath that first braid we started. And she's just, I've pulled the feathers um, from the top here and she's just holding them. If you're doing this on a younger girl um, and they can't or won't hold them, then you can just take a clip and clip them over here out of the way. But I'm just going to have her hold them for right now. So we're going to split this into three sections and start another braid. Now this is going to be like a lace braid too, but instead of picking up hair from the head, we're going to pick up these feathered pieces that we pulled from the top braid. And each time we go, we're just going to add one in. 
So then we're just going to cross the bottom back over and go back to the top. Add in another piece. We're just going to repeat these steps until we have added in all of those feathered pieces. Okay, once we have incorporated all of the feathered pieces from that top braid, we're now just going to finish this braid off in a regular braid as well. Okay, so this is our finished style for today. Now, I mentioned in the intro that I would show you a, a couple of different ways that you could style this. Well, for one thing, you could have just done the laced feather braid on the top and left it at that, and that would have been really cute too. And if you wanted to do the ladder braid, you could do it like this, and you could feather the rest of this braid all the way down to the bottom without adding in any more hair from the top, and then incorporate all of those into this braid and you'd have a lighter braid going all the way down. Another th fun thing you could do with it is do the lighter braid all the way down and then sweep all of the hair over into a side ponytail with the lighter running down the side ponytail. So it's really versatile. You can do a lot of different things with these braids in this style. But this is how we're going to leave it today. So that's it for this one. We really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please be sure and give the video a thumbs up. Show us some love. And click subscribe down below. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Instagram at Sugar and Spice Hairstyles. Those links will be in the description bar down below. And also don't forget to go check out our beauty channel, ASK Beauty and More. That link will also be in the description bar down below. So if you're interested, please go check it out and subscribe to that channel as well. We would love to have you all as part of our YouTube family here on Sugar and Spice and over at ASK Beauty and More. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.